Um, oh, give it up for the wait staff here, by the way. Give them a round of applause, right? Because it sucks working in the customer service industry, right? Because people will blame you for stuff that is not your fault. Like, I was working at a restaurant one time. This lady gave me the, come here, young man, finger. And I was like, well, yeah, miss, what seems to be the problem? She goes, this is the worst lemonade I've ever had in my life. <laughs> and I want a new one. And I was like, oh. well, I shot this out of a gun. So there is no new one. <laughs> like, I don't have a guy from country time back here just put more sugar in it. People liked it bitter in the 20s, you know. <laughs> like, the best I can do is give you the same lemonade and a different glass. That's as far as this goes. But when I was working at this restaurant, and I'm not joking, it was this restaurant. This was the first job I had in Chicago at Timothy O'Toole, so we're in the side of it. Yeah. Career-wise, I shouldn't be here right now, but uh, 13 years later, you don't want to be in the same spot. Uh, for those who can't see this place, it's just if Chili's were Irish. I want my baby back, baby back, baby back. I want my baby back, baby back, baby back. I want my baby back. My father loved a baked potato. <laughs> Chili's, before he passed. But this restaurant, it's right by Northwestern Hospital, you know? So this guy came in with a neurosurgeon tag on, which, by the way, fuck off. You don't need to wear that out. Like, <laughs> I get it. You're better than me, okay? Like $8,000 a second dissecting brains. I make $8 an hour saying, you sit here. Like, you won. You know? <laughs> so this neurosurgeon comes in, right? And I thought I'd joke around him. I was like, oh, neurosurgeon. And he's like, yeah. I was like, do you guys ever mess up in brain surgery? And then you turn to each other and go, come on, it's not rocket science. <laughs> and then he goes, no, right? And then he walks off without laughing. I was like, oh, that was a dick move. <laughs> and then I thought, maybe it's a dick move on my part, you know? Because if you're a rocket scientist or a brain surgeon, everyone expects you to know everything. But you're really only qualified in that field. It's got to be annoying. You're a rocket scientist. You have your friends over just like, hey, hey, we're going to watch the game? No. Ted can't figure out his TiVo. What? <laughs> I thought he was a rocket scientist. <laughs> yeah, supposedly. <laughs> no wonder Challenger blew up. Hmm? <laughs> Not too soon, the rule's 18 years. Once a tragedy hits the age of consent, you can joke about it. You know? I wrote that joke when I was two, so there's gonna be gold. <laughs> Just wait, Fernandez, you know?